Hey guys, today I'm talking about D076 Finance Skills for Managers at WGU and how to get through this course as quickly as possible. So for me, it only took me about two to three days to get through, um, even not being insanely familiar with the subject. The first thing you need to make sure is that you have My Educator all set up. You want to have a download, you'll need it for the unit tests, the PA, and the OA. And if you've installed Microsoft Office through WGU, which they give you like a free copy of you can use, um, you can look up that if you need it. Um, you should have it, and if not, you can download that and set it up before you start because you're going to need all of that stuff from Excel to get through this. All right, so only took a couple days, you know, I went through the cohorts and everything I put on 1.5 to two times speed to power through because the instructors talk very slowly and to get through all of that. Highly recommend going through all of the unit quizzes and tests. They really line up very well with the PA and OA. And then after finishing the text, I also went back and watched cohort videos again um, and taking notes to just kind of drill in anything that I wasn't understanding or was missing. And then once I finished the material, I took the PA through my educator. I scored pretty much right on the dot of passing. So I gave myself a couple extra days to clean up anything I wasn't understanding before I took the OA. I went through the quizzes, rewatched the videos, and then focused on the things I was having trouble with. And then I took the OA and easily passed. And so some things to really focus on is you don't have to remember exact equations, but you want to understand how the equations are working and how to apply them. So just understand the concept of the equations. You want to be comfortable with Excel functions. Once again, it's not about memorizing them, but it's knowing where you need to put stuff in Excel. And then units three, five, and six make up about 70% of the tests with unit three being the heaviest at 30%. So you really want to focus mainly on unit three. Overall, it's not a bad class at all. Um, Excel is very scary. I have literally zero experience with Excel. So going through those cohorts made a big difference with me being actually comfortable to do the equations. So if I can do it without pretty much never using Excel, you can definitely do it, especially if you have some prior Excel experience. Um, use the cohort to your advantage, focus on the Excel functions, specifically MPV versus PI versus IRR, and the high weighted units. If you do that, you'll be more than ready to pass and crush this course. If you have any questions for me, just let me know down in the comments. Make sure you like and sub for more WGU videos and tips like this, and I will see you in the next one. Thanks for watching.